I'm Pamela Pagano here live at Cartier de Spectacle, and I am honored to be joined by the Sima Aurora, who actually completed her 2022 New Year's resolution. Sima, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. So, Sima, I'm going to actually take these glasses off. I have some rain on them. Oh, all right, we'll put this down here. Oh, live TV. So now, Sima, tell us, oh, everyone wants to know, what was your New Year's resolution? So my New Year's resolution was to do a show to bring Anglophones and Francophones together and to show diverse talent, some of the most amazing talent we have in Montreal, speaking an excellent French. I really feel that we don't have that a lot in the media where we show that. And I think everybody knows uh, most kids have to go to French school here. And that includes all the diverse Montrealers. And so I felt like that's not represented enough in the media. And I wanted to bring something where people could feel represented, Anglophones and Francophones too. So this show is called Fun with French. But now tell us, who are we joined by right here? <laughs> ah, it's me, the Fun with French guy. What's going on? <laughs> Are you tell us? I'm Manny, the fun with French guy. You are the fun with French guy, and you are certainly very fun. I love this energy. Now, is Sima, actually, you know what? I'm going to ask Manny a question. Manny, tell us how do you feel being a part of a show that was a New Year's resolution that was completed? Um, very fortunate. I'm very proud that I answered the call. Um, there's a breakdown that came about. I looked at it. I connected with Sima. We had a couple of Zooms and they let me know like what the project was all about. So as a fellow Montrealer, I'm very proud to be the fun with French guy. Um, and, you know, just educating all the people with some new words. Oh, amazing. And episode three is coming out soon. And in these episodes now, you go around to people who are actors, right? And you ask them if they know a certain French word. Do you have a French word for me that I can guess. It's, it's going to be a doozy word, give, give a doozy her, French her word, word <laughs> as we call it on our show. So let's see if you know, Pamela. The word of the day today is pénard. Pénard? Pénard, do you know what pénard is? I think it means pain in the ass. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> We're on live TV! <laughs> Sorry about that. Well, I'm not too sure. What does it mean? Okay, I'll guess. Pinard. Is it like party time? I don't know. <laughs> well, okay, I'll tell you. So, Pinard means like cushion, cushiony, you know, comfortable in a cool oh. zone. Whoops. And party I'm going to put that in a sentence for everybody so they could see how it's uh, the context of it. So, come. Quand mon équipe et moi, on va gagner un Oscar, on va être peinard. Really? In a good zone, in a place where things are falling into place, and finally we can have the funding we need for our projects, which is really tough in Montreal to get. 